The Anahiki no Kugiri saw is a beam cutting saw used for general construction or timber framing. So I won this saw off of eBay, and when it arrived from Japan, the blade needed to be put into the handle. With the saw blade and the handle, I couldn't believe this thing was as long as an axe. Before we see the saw in action, let's take a look at some of the stats. The overall length with the handle is 37 and a quarter inches or 945 millimeters. There's a 410 millimeter cutting area on the blade or about 16 inches. The height of the blade starts at just about 70 millimeters or two and three quarter inches and is 97 millimeters or three and seven eighths inches at the highest part. Like other Japanese saw blades, there are small teeth near the handle get the cut started and longer teeth near the tip of the blade. The thickness of the blade is less than a millimeter thick, or less than 1 16th of an inch thick. What better way to test out a timber framing saw than to cut a piece of African sumac into some small slabs. So while I was doing these cuts, I tried a couple different body positions. The hardest thing I found to do was to make sure that my left hand was pressing down parallel to the cut and not applying pressure sideways. On the last cut I figured out that I got a fairly straight cut by cutting on the diagonal from both sides of the log instead of more perpendicular to the log. When it was all said and done, it took about an hour to do those three cuts. Well, I'd like to thank you for watching. Barda's Shop Dog Outtakes are next. If you could help us out by liking and sharing the video, I'd really appreciate it. Also, if you're interested in behind the scenes stuff, check us out on the social media links in the description. Get out there and make something with what you got, and we'll see you next time.